What's up guys, Greg here with Lens Protego and Lens Rentals, and in today's video, we're gonna be taking a look at the exposure recovery of the Panasonic GH5S. We're gonna over and underexpose it about five stops and see how much we can pull back in post-production. All of our camera settings are gonna be noted in the description below, so go and check that out if you wanna see a little more information. Otherwise, let's get right into the first test, underexposing the GH5S. So here we are with our correct exposure. We're at F8 ISO 800, and we're gonna start by underexposing our image by one stop. On the left side, you'll see the actual shot, so that's where we're underexposed one stop, and on the right is our recovered shot, and that's what we've been able to bring back in post-production. Here we are two stops underexposed down to an F16, and we're able to recover that a decent amount. You are seeing a little bit of noise, but this is definitely usable. Going down to three stops underexposed, we are seeing a little bit more noise, but we're not really having too much of a color shift, which is really good. Down to four stops underexposed, again, we're getting a ton of noise, and this is probably unusable at this point, and we're starting to see a tiny bit of magenta shift. And then all the way down to five stops underexposed, almost completely black, we're able to bring it back, but have a ton of noise, a lot of colors in there as well with the green and magenta. Going back to our correct exposure at F8 ISO 800, we're now gonna go in the opposite direction and overexpose the image. So we are one stop overexposed at an F5.6. You can see that on the left side there and then our recovered shot is on the right. Here we are two stops overexposed at an F4. We're starting to get a little bit blown out in our actual shot, but we're able to recover most of that in our face, not so much in the mug that you can see in the top. Now we're three stops overexposed, and this is basically washing out most of the image and we're not able to bring this back. Here we are four stops overexposed, open up to an F2, and again, this is completely unusable. We're washed out, no detail in the face or in any of the other colors. And then five stops, again, same thing, completely washed out, unable to recover a lot of that overexposed image. Hope you got something out of this exposure recovery test of the Panasonic GH5S. If you did, let everybody else know by hitting that like button. And if you wanna try it out for yourself, there'll be links in the description below. Also, don't forget to subscribe for new videos every single week, and I'll see you in the next one.